11 Alive News at 11 starts now. Good evening and welcome. I'm Brenda Wood. Ted Hall has the night off. We begin tonight with a developing story with it. From the first local station with news and high definition, this is 9 News Now. And we're on storm alert again as we kick off this holiday weekend. Topper standing by in the way. The leader in HD. This is 12 News Evening Edition. Good evening. The bulls take over as stocks soar. Google investors have... From Tampa Bay's news leader, this is 10 News at 5. A man suspected of killing his own mother here in the Bay Area is shot dead by police in Alabama. What led up to the violent confrontation just ahead in a live report? You're watching CARE 11 News in high definition. This is CARE 11 News at 4. From Colorado's high definition news leader, this is 9 News at 6. Caught, the FBI says the shaggy bandit was seen inside another bank this afternoon. Alert tellers called authorities, and tonight, a suspect is in custody. Good evening, everyone. I'm Mark Cobra. I'm Adela Rakawa. The arrest came late today, and the story continues to develop with the suspect. This Channel 3 HD newscast is brought to you by your Northeast Ohio Ford dealers with quality built Ford cars and trucks. Visit driveonohio.com. From the WKYC Digital Broadcast Center, this is Channel 3 News. Good evening, I'm Ramona Robinson. We begin with thunderstorms moving our way. Let's get right to meteorologist Bruce Kalinowski for a look at what we can expect. This is News 10 at 5. We begin tonight with developing news out of Placerville. Tyler Witt, a teenage girl accused of killing her mother, changes her plea today. In high definition, this is News Channel 5, where the news comes first. You know, it wouldn't hurt to have a break, and we're hoping that this reward will, will provide that break. Charges are filed against... From West Michigan's Information Center... WCCM 13 News is on your side. Happening at 11, a West Michigan man is shot and killed by a deputy after a traffic... This is WFMY News 2. I know it's going to be busy and I'm going to be running around. And that's something businesses want more of. Answers to tough economic times and... From the Information Center of First Coast News, this is First Coast News at 7. Good evening, I'm Patty Crosby. Thanks for joining me, Steve Smith and Dan Hicken on the... From Western New York's Information Center, Channel 2 News tonight starts now. They think you didn't have any help and you got in over your head and, and that's how this whole thing happened. Horses return. Hear from the woman who had her animals taken... On the air and on the web, this is Today's THB at Noon with Stephanie Bryant and Tom Brannan. Hey there, and welcome to Today's THB at Noon. I'm Stephanie Bryant. Hey, I'm Tom Brannan on uh, what's turning out to be a very hot Friday. Hot here at noon, hot in terms of... You are watching WBIR-TV Channel 10 Knoxville. The news starts now. Possible bowl bid is on the line for the volunteers as they take on the Commodores. Good evening and thanks for watching 10 News at 6. I'm Sean Dreyer. Yvette Martinez is off. To this is News Center at 6. Good evening. I'm Caroline Cornish. A New York Times reporter who went to Freiburg Academy is back in the U.S. after escaping the Taliban. Now, from the station that's on your side, this is News 19, WLTX. And good evening. Thanks for being with us. I'm J.R. Barry. And I'm Darcy Strickland. Coverage straight from the heart. This is 13 WMAZ Eyewitness News at 6.